up Kilo Crew and welcome to today's video. Today I'm at Remy's Deep Dish Pizza and Bar in the middle of Adelaide CBD right outside of the, uh, the mall's balls, which is not a fake thing, I promise. But anyways, I'm about to tuck in to Remy's Royal Rumble Challenge, which involves eating a massive deep dish pizza. So I'm going to have only 30 minutes to finish the first ever deep dish pizza in Australia, which is pretty darn cool, inspired by Giordano's. But in front of me, I have the king of all pizzas, the pepperoni and cheese marinara sauce classic right here. This is a two and a half kilo pizza along with a big old side of their fries. And then I got some ranch on the side, which is optional. But the thing that is super scary is this liter of beer. I went with Remy's way too easy lager, which is like a four percentish beer, which is like 3% too high for me. But anyways, 30 minutes to finish all this. If I'm successful, I will be only the second person ever to defeat this thing. The only other winner ever has been the same fella who I was trying to beat in uh, in Brighton the other day at Cream, Mr. Big V. So he did this in like seven and a half minutes. We ain't gonna talk about that. That is insane. I'm just hoping to finish this in under 30. But of course, if I'm successful, I do get the meal for free and I do get a spot up next to Mr. Big V on the Wall of Fame. So without further delay, let's pull our hair back and get this challenge started. <laughs> Okay, cool, I like it. One, two, three, pizza eating time, here we go. What? Oh, oh, now that is sexy, okay. I can see why this is called the king of all pizzas. I think that might have been the king of all cheese bowls. Wow. Even this early on, I was beginning to switch from impressed to terrified by this much cheese. Can I get some pizza with my cheese? Mm. I watched them weigh this pizza out, and I'm telling you, it was about a two and a half kilo pizza, but I think two kilos of it was cheese. Well, alrighty then. All right, that is enough about cheese for now. Let's talk about the pizza itself. It was an exquisite deep dish pizza and inspired directly by Giordano's famous Chicago pizza. I took cheese to the eye. And what is a food challenge without a few war wounds anyway? <laughs> this one was absolutely worth it. And either way, I was more terrified by the one liter of beer than I really was by all the cheese. And maybe it should have been the other way around. Try some fries. Ooh. These are exactly the kind of fries I don't mind eating during a food challenge. And what a surprise that it was at a pizza place. Good shoestring style fries. Try some ranch. Didn't end up using too much of the ranch. The fries really didn't need any sauce of any sort. Just ended up kind of jamming them down, knowing that I needed all the time I could get for that beer. Pizza and beer, can't go wrong. Oh, I'm gonna need a lot of fiber after this. Okay, that was an unnecessary comment, but uh, hey, it's true, I guess. That was a lot of cheese, and I'm still talking about the cheese because that was most of this pizza, obviously. <sighs> Two slices down, which is kind of scary. Yeah, if it looks as though I'm eating even more impolitely than usual, uh, it's because I am. I knew that I really needed to rush through this, but I was gonna leave myself enough time to finish the pizza and of course, the beer. Whew, empty. Okay, 559, six minutes in. Mm-hmm. Doing great, man, keep it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't feel like I was doing too great at this point. At six minutes in, I only had a couple slices of the pizza down and maybe like a little over half the fries and we were approaching Vince's record. All right, final bite of fries. Oh boy, this is madness. That is like a block of mozzarella. You can see there that it's starting to get a little bit more difficult to stretch the mozzarella, which is right when it's at the dangerous point. So I had to start being way more cautious. Uh. Ooh. 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 I think I'm through the smaller half of this pie. Not a lot of time, so not a lot of talking, and I'm also eating like a mess. Resurfacing for air. Ugh. God rest my digestive system. Thank you. Oh, here we go. It was about at this point that I realized why only one person ever had defeated this thing in the two years that this challenge had been going on. This was so much cheese and just so much food in general. 
The beer is good. The mozzarella is at the dangerous point right now to where it uh, stretches down your throat, so you have to be really careful. <clears throat> that was a frightening moment. With some clever editing, I made that look a little less frightening than it actually was. Ironically, the beer kind of saved the day. That was my hero moment there, so big thank you to the leader of beer, but yeah, I was definitely going to play it a little bit more safe from here on out. Really, if you try this challenge, instead of just sitting down and enjoying a beer here, you are an idiot. Enjoy a beer, enjoy some pizza. I'm just kidding, if you wanna try it, go for it. It's gonna hurt, okay. Honestly, at this point, I just wanted some of the Nutella pie that I saw on the menu and a, and a casual stout. That was me trying to show y'all a cross section of this pizza. Just three simple ingredients married together to make a delicious, albeit difficult, food challenge. Mm -hmm. Less than that, give me some credit. One and a bit, one and a bit pieces to go. <laughs> I needed every little bit of motivation and encouragement I could get at this point. All right, let's get on to this final slice of pizza. <laughs> This is the biggest boy of all the boys. This is the big boss, the big Goomba, the final slice. Right, right, nothing like saving the biggest and best for last, but on that very uh, burpy final note, I'm gonna leave you guys to enjoy the rest of this video. Thank you all so much for watching. And I'll of course catch you all in the next one. She's worried, she's worried about the beer. Yeah. That's easy. I'm Go cool. on. Final bite of this two pounds of cheese pizza, two kilos of cheese pizza. On to the beer. Cheers, everyone. in me, not one liter. Oh, I was never a sorority girl. <laughs> We're trying. Better to play it safe. I just have to finish the beer. Oh, I'd be real full, y'all. For straw, you mate. Oh, those were juicy. You wanted me to stop. Oh. I'm so glad I was never in a sorority. Me too. <laughs> Ugh, I got a burp for 10 more minutes. Hold on. Ugh. Stop it. Get some help. Okay, I have burped at least enough times, half a dozen. 23 minutes and 51 seconds. Was the final time. Uh, hey. A big thank you to all these crazy stry and party animals for cheering me on during all of that. Uh, I am very lucky that I came away with a win there. That was a lot of beer and a big old pizza, but mad props to Remy's for having an excellent pizza. The first ever Chicago style deep dish pizza in all of Straya mate, but uh, that was absolutely delicious. Easily two kilos of cheese, which was character building, but I love cheese, so that was cool. Uh, the beer was awesome as well. That was, that was 
Wait, 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 chilled out? Wait, wait. Why can't I get that? That was way too easy, but not easy in a leader format. But anyways, luckily for winning, I do get the meal for free. I do get to sign my name right underneath Mr. Big V's name on the Wall of Fame. And uh, I do get to just have bragging rights that I just did that for all these people. Uh, so a big thank you to everyone here. Extra Ramays because this is so darn popular. But uh, oh, thank you guys so much for watching. I will of course catch you all in the next video. Okay, peace out, Haru. Josh, you had a quick grind to kill me.